it's just like yeah i'm that girl that's how i got it <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Kay Alexis and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is the first video of the year and I'm here to say that I am back and better than ever. I know I was really inconsistent when it came to YouTube last year, but this year I am giving everything that I'm supposed to give. So today I have a short little haul for you all. Um, we have some Hermes, we have some Louis, and then we just have like a couple pairs of shoes. Um, a lot of this stuff I was actually supposed to do unboxings for on YouTube last year, like late last year, but I was just busy, like with work, with life, just super busy. So I did not do the unboxing on YouTube, but if you follow me on Instagram and TikTok, then you might have already seen some of these items. So enough talking about it. Let's get right into it. Okay, so the first item that we have, we are going to unbox from Hermes. Look at this beautiful orange box. Yesterday, we went to Hermes. I was supposed to vlog it, but I'm just lazy, so I didn't, um, I didn't vlog it. Let's go ahead and unbox it. Let me take it out of the bag. I absolutely love this item bag. I got and we do have the ribbon and stuff in here. I've already did an unboxing for TikTok, so that's why the ribbon is not on here, unfortunately. But, as you can see, by the size of the box, it's not a bracket, unfortunately. But soon come, I'm manifesting it. In about a year or two, I will have my dream Birkin or Kelly. I could feel it. I really can feel it. Take that off. And of course, it's shoes. Duh. What else would it be? So I picked up these Oran sandals in yellow. I absolutely love this color. Um, I've been, I don't know. I've been looking at these for a while and I've seen tons of like reviews and stuff about it, about how they're not comfortable. Um, all of this stuff and I was just like uh, okay I'm not gonna worry about them I was really interested in the what's it called the shy prey shy pre I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right I'm not French or anything so forgive me um, I was really interested in those but they did not have the particular color that I wanted in store so um, I was like let me get the around like let me just try them on and see if I like them try them on they fit true to size you do not need to size up or anything they fit absolutely true to size walked around in them for a little while and they were so comfortable um i was really looking for like an orange pair but then i seen this yellow and i was like hmm i don't wear much yellow but on um, black skin yellow looks absolutely amazing i kind of just want like a full rainbow of Hermes Oran sandals. I mean, why not? But these are truly sized. They're super comfortable. I absolutely love them. I love all the different colors that they come in. And I cannot wait to buy more. And I cannot wait to wear these during the summer. Moving on to the next item, we have Louis. Absolutely love Louis. Um, this, I got this item. Let's see. I was on a business trip for my job. We went to, I went to Chicago for a business trip. That was in November maybe, so November of 2021. Um, my boyfriend came on that business trip with me. I was there for the entire week for work, and then we decided to extend the trip over the weekend. Um, I absolutely love Chicago. I was born there, I used to live there. So I went to go see family that I haven't seen in a while. We had us a really good time. And I decided to pick me up a bag that I was actually looking for a bag. Not necessarily this one, but I did want a new bag. I was going in between like Chanel or just something else. I wanted a vintage Chanel flap. But with that, that's just another story. We'll maybe make another video about that later. This is... This is how it looks. Absolutely love this. 
And I already told you what it was. It's a bag, clearly. And this is it. It is so cute. So it looks pretty basic, right? Like this. This is their trunk, monogram trunk bag. I actually forgot what's the, what's the name of it. I forgot the name of it, but what I will do is link it if they still have it online. Um, in the description box. My favorite thing about this bag is how versatile it is. So I will wear it like this, you know, if it's like date night or going to like a small little party or something, I would definitely wear it like this. You can also take this off and just wear it like as a clutch if you wanted to. You could definitely just wear this as a clutch, hold it in hand, again, if you were going to like a party date night whatever you can do just that so that's two different ways you're able to wear it so far as like just like a little handle bag or as well as just like a clutch to hold in your hand but this bag comes with another strap okay finally got the strap on that took freaking forever you could wear crossbody like this if you wanted to or you could wear it on your shoulder like this. That's literally four different ways I showed you how you could wear this bag. It is literally one of my favorite bags that I've purchased um, in a really long time. I've been wearing this bag, I'm not gonna say nonstop, but I've worn this bag a good amount of times. I absolutely love it because it's just so versatile. Another thing I discovered is that this long strap right here, you can actually put around your waist and wear it like as a belt if you wanted to. It might be not the best idea, but you could definitely make it work. So if you have like an oversized blazer and you want to just put this around, cause it looks like a belt anyway. If you have this oversized blazer and you just want to put this around your waist, you could definitely wear this as a belt. Um, I will show you all if I do wear that, maybe like in another um, fashion or style video that I would do down the line. But I absolutely love this bag. It's so versatile. It's the best investment piece that I've bought in a very long time. Moving on to our last and final item. This is something that I bought from good old Saks Fifth Avenue. This is a pair of shoes. I might as well just go ahead and tell you all now. It is a pair of shoes from a brand. It's not exactly new, but it's new to a lot of people. These are shoes from Awake Mode. I don't know if it's pronounced Awake mode or it's pronounced A-W-A-K-E mode. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm going to say awake mode. These are shoes from awake mode. And I've been eyeing these for a while. And I seen them on Saks.com and I was in the mood to spend some money. So I was just like, okay, why not? Get them. They're different for what you have. You don't have anything like this in your um, wardrobe, 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 shoe collection. You don't have anything like this in your shoe collection. That's what we're gonna say. It reminds me of Old Celine. I forgot the name of the shoe that it reminds me of, but I know it's Old Celine. And I wanted this fucking shoe so bad. And I have the biggest feet in the world and I just can't find it anywhere. But it's these amazing shoes from Awake Mode that I absolutely love. So they're two different colors, this tan, this black, and your big toe sticks out right here, and the rest of your toes are covered there. And for this one, the rest of the toe sticks out and the big toe is covered. So they are really different, but I absolutely love them. This is the heel height for them. Um, it's a pretty decent heel, but I know for me, I like weird looking, sh weird looking shoes like this. Um, I think because the way I dress is super simple, I like to have like weird looking shoes or a weird bag or a pop of color within my bag and shoes. 
So this is perfect. If you know the name of those old Celine shoes that I'm referring to that are similar to this, please let me know in the comments because I forgot the name. Like it's like right here stuck in my mind, but it, it just won't come out. But I absolutely love these shoes. They are so comfortable. I would definitely get your true size when it comes to a Wegmo shoes. Okay guys, well that is the end of today's haul. Thank you all for tuning in. Um, I just wanna say, I am so excited about this journey that I'm taking with YouTube and content creation. It's really something that I absolutely enjoy. I got a taste of it at the end of last year with like content creation for TikTok as well as Instagram. Now I am adding YouTube to the roster and I'm just so excited excited to see what this journey will, um, where it would take me. I'm so excited to just meet you all and gain you all as like YouTube family, learn from you all and just enjoy creating fashion content for you all. So if you enjoyed this video, please do not forget to give me a thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel. There is so much more to come. I'm going to be consistent and we're gonna have a lot of fun. So thank you all for tuning in and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.